Hello and welcome to Formula V at uh, Olten Park, uh, the Foster's configuration. Good old Foster's home for imaginary friends today. Uh, going without the, uh, <laughs> my old friend, speaking of friends, the driving line. Um, I feel like uh, I've been at this track enough times that uh, I should probably <laughs> get myself off of that. For now, um, a lot of the times I'm going to tracks for the first time, so it feels like I need it, but uh, I don't want to over rely on it too much. So uh, I think I should be okay this time. Did my practice, kind of looked for those breaking points. Um, I only ever really used it for the breaking points anyway, so uh, in practice I kind of just took the extra time to. Uh, identify things outside or around the track to uh, help remember my breaking points so that's cool um, you know I feel okay not great not perfect but okay don't think I, I'm gonna have race winning speed or anything like that but um, I think I could have a solid run today I am the number three so um, I'm not sure if I can get third but um, still might be able to do all right. Oh, under drove that. That's a scary corner, though. Um, so that's a, I'd rather underdrive it than overdrive it. It's very easy to end up on the other side of the death wall. Speaking of death, that uh, <laughs> it's I don't know what it is about that corner, but I always put my left side tires off into the grass there and then you just go straight when you do that because you don't have the turn I don't know what it is um, maybe the left sides are just wider than I'm expecting but it's only like that corner that I have problems with I don't know it's uh, not the greatest lap here compared to my best uh, lap in practice but no biggie And then here is also a place that's really easy to overdrive and end up uh, in the grass. Kind of have to wait a little bit to hit the throttle. And my experience seems to be the truth. V2. Yeah, still kind of get trying to get that turned down without the driving line. So, going to be a little slower than I would be with it on, but... Uh, at least I won't look like a chump. <laughs> I don't actually believe that, but, uh, well, I ruined that. <laughs> there goes the lap. Um, I don't actually believe that. I think it's fine to use the driving line personally for people that are lazy like me and don't want to memorize the braking points most of the time, but, uh, whatever. If I'm going to be, uh, putting videos on the internet, I'm giving them ammo by being like, you use the driving line. That doesn't count. So, uh, I'll turn it off, and uh, instead of having an easy braking marker to look at, I'll look at that little, I don't know what that is, what's that little building there? That's what I'm using. That's my braking marker instead. So, that was a terrible lap. But the first lap was decent, I guess. Um, I think uh, pe most people's second lap would probably be faster. So they know what they're doing, so and not messing up like me. So um, we'll drop back a little bit, I'm sure. It's uh, I'm okay with that lap I had. Got a lap that counted, and that means something. Hmm. Yeah, I wanna, maybe you gotta slow down a little bit more. I'm trying to balance uh, for that corner. Trying to balance uh, how long I'm on the brakes versus how long I'm rolling through. Because you gotta get uh, slowed down to the right speed, but you want to get uh, get rolling so you can get around the corner and hit a, the accelerator as soon as you can. Because there's a lot of straight afterward, so you want a good run off. It's important. Um, there's gonna be a lot of draft as usual in a Formula V race too, so we're gonna have to watch out for that as well. Hopefully don't get any crazy dives, but uh, 
it's not unlikely so we'll have to be vigilant watching the mirror and uh, not be the diver ourselves as well don't be that guy yeah, that was pretty decent I just uh, I think I'm just messing my turn in angle um, it's probably where I'm missing out in that first corner It's a little better, I guess. But uh, my old time best was done with the driving line on, so um, this is about as good as it's going to get, I think, with it off as I adjust. Because I don't know if I can say I'm brand new to road anymore. I've done enough road races now where I'm starting to get enough experience. To say, well, I'm not good yet, but um, this is my first race, kind of thing. What's the next step? I guess you get like rookie, and then uh, I don't know, novice or something, and then what's the next thing? Familiar, vaguely familiar. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> So we dropped down to sixth. Still not too bad. As usual in a Formula V race, a big part of it's just surviving. It's a little extra bit of practice. Seems to be helping my lap times, but uh, of course the fuel's burning off as well, so gonna be naturally a little faster. How much time we got? Just about a minute. Oh god, am I at last? Maybe I'm terrible. Hold on a second. I might be terrible. <laughs> I didn't realize I qualified last. Well, maybe this will not be as good as I thought. Hmm. I don't know. Twelve four was what I had. That's not too bad. If, if I'm hitting laps like that lap, should be okay, because that last lap was a 12-1. 12-1 would have put me top five. So the Q lap wasn't too good, but I think I should be able to keep up reasonably well. I just gotta hit this corner a little better and you know kind of put it all together. Mid-pack, that's cool. Ah, there's a fly in here. It's also really hot in here. It's kind of that time of year where uh, you're getting a mix between warm and cold days outside. I'm in Missouri, central United States, so um, it's kind of transitioning into the fall temperatures. So we've had the uh, the air conditioning off for a bit. But now it's like kind of hot outside today, and we don't want to turn it back on and be like, oh, we're kind of done with that for this year, but now it's hot, and so we got the window open and the fan going, but it's not quite enough. I'm kind of sweating, kind of that awkward middle time. So it's like I'm actually in the race car now, except this would probably feel really good, open air. Uh, let me get ready, because this isn't a rolling start. <laughs> I'm sitting here like... Oh, when are we going to start rolling? Uh, fast repair is ready. Let's get uh, oops, session all time. Uh, first lap's just going to be get, being careful. Uh, so, I'm not going to have to worry about going all that fast. Um, I think I'm going to temper my expectations a bit. And just kind of hope for a... Uh, I don't know, there's only like 12 people in here, but maybe just like a top five or something. Since uh, I've got my driving line off, even that might be a little optimistic, but I think uh, there's going to be enough people crashing out that uh, if I success successfully don't crash out, should be a pretty good spot. But we'll see. Shouldn't be too much longer now. I think we just got maybe one person not on the grid yet. 
There we go. All right. Get this back going. Good start. But, uh, we got nowhere to go with it right now because I'm not going to make any dumb moves. Easy on the throttle. Looks like we got some just a tiny bit of room behind us, so that's uh, that's good. We'll watch for carnage here. Could easily happen. All right. No one ran into the back of us. No one ran uh, into someone in front of them either. So nice job. I don't think anyone wrecked. It's pretty rare in any road series. So everyone's being at least somewhat patient, it seems. All right, guys. Good stuff. Okay. Don't spin it here. Like that guy. Oh, don't kill me. I saw him coming back. <laughs> It's a scary feeling when you see someone losing it and all of a sudden they're pointing towards the track. Alright. So, top five. Looking good. Tires are still going to be somewhat cold, so i got to be careful. Be very uh, gentle with the steering wheel. I think we're faster than the guys behind us, so uh, give it some time and we'll have some extra distance to breathe. Ooh, that pushed a little bit, I think, because I'm coming in there a little faster due to the draft. We've got to take it a little softer going in. Or the tires just don't have as much grip right now. That could be. Oh! That could be it too. Those guys exploded. <laughs> How did they get up behind me already? Did I miss something? Alright, easy with the off track there. Is this guy. Why is this guy so close to me? Why are you taking that much risk? I don't think you need to be that close to get past someone in the... Oh, Formula V. Man, he's cutting it so close. Give me a break, dude. Gonna let go. Ready to race yet? Not like that. <sighs> I'll be a little baby if it means that uh, yeah, <laughs> I survive. That's probably one of my worst corners. That there last one. Guys, let's keep um, going, Kyle. Let's work together. <laughs> this guy. Directing traffic. That's cool. Working together, he says. I agree with him, but uh, seems kind of lame to be like telling what people what to do. Kyle's not interested in what David is selling in terms of <laughs> don't race yet. So I wonder if they're going to wreck and then David's going to be real mad and he's going to yell at him, I told you, blah, 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 blah. That's a, if I end up in fourth, that's cool with me too. I do enjoy this draft I'm getting. A little loose. Uh, tires are feeling better now. 
can take things a little harder. Keep searching, you'll find a gap. But your best luck in the session. <sighs> and get some good laps in too. Because of this draft. Look at that. Look at how fast I'm going. Gonna have to remember to change my breaking points too. Not uh, to get those left sides off the track like I was talking about when I was uh, doing those uh, practice laps. I remember giving myself more room than I think I need. I think this nine's coming up on us. I have to watch out for that. Kyle insists on trying to pass this guy right here, which is probably the worst place on the track to try to pass someone. I think you want to just follow him through there and then try to get him right here maybe that's probably your better safer bet probably more successful too okay, it. Up. Feels good. maybe uh, he was hoping he would back out like I did for him because I uh, I didn't trust making it through there not so much turned in a little better there but I think we're okay Mine's hanging on pretty well. Cause he can dive it in there harder because we can we have to be a little more pensive because we got people in front of us through that corner. So I think that's helping him catch up. How much time we got? Five minutes? Alright, so still about three, four laps. There he goes again. He insists on trying to pass him there. I swear they're gonna hit each other one of these times. Oh, nope, he backs out. Okay, well, that was scary. Didn't expect him to do that. <laughs> Suddenly he was coming at me. So the nine's here now. I'm gonna let him by too if uh, he reaches us. Oh, now he's trying to pass here. See, that's what I was saying he should probably try to do. And look, it worked. Looky there. That was the better thing to try all along. But now you're just in a line again. So, not sure what you accomplished. Except, I mean, I guess you got a position on him, but... But, so uh, you're just all going to be in a pack here because of the draft. Nine can definitely make it through that corner faster, but I hope he realizes that... Well, we all could, but we don't want to run into the guy in front of us, so. Six might be backing up because he expects these two guys to wreck. Kinda don't blame him. Certainly not gonna go for a move on him right now. I'm nervous about this orange guy behind me. Didn't know if he was gonna try to dive it in there. No one's going to be able to run away from anyone right now, so. Did you pick the worst to pass out? Learn to race, bro. Yeah, that's exactly what I was saying. That's what I was just saying. He picks the worst corners to try to pass them on. I'm not even interested in passing right now. I think I don't even want to pass through the last lap, to be honest. Appreciate that the orange has not destroyed me from behind yet. I know he's probably a little unhappy that uh, he's been held up, but he might know what's up in terms of this draft dealio. So. Have a choice there. Still there, hold your line. Alright, Colton, let's 
kind of get decided for me. I'm just gonna do this. I'm not too interested in racing. Going ahead nine. There's a big enough gap behind us that I am okay with taking it easy peasy. Don't wreck in front of me though. That's not allowed. There's an incident somewhere on the track. I don't know the names of the corners, so it doesn't help me when he's like, incident and dead man's curve, and I'm like, I don't know where that is, but it sounds scary. Okay, well, this guy can't keep up with him, apparently. I don't know. Or maybe he's hanging back, too. I'm trying to drive right now. Yeah, same. Just trying to draft right now. Oh, my God, I barely avoided that. Not so sure I like this deal. Okay. Well, that was not the position to be in there, and I just gave butt loads of room. That's cool. I'll take fourth if that's what we end up with. They could wreck up there too, going for the win. Top five was my goal. That's what we're uh, what we're headed for. It looks like. That looked like a lot of smoke. Did they wreck for the win? You know it. Don't block me. Thank you. All right, podium. Good race, guys. All right, we'll park on over here. This is my favorite. Uh, Parking spot. Yeah, I was just being patient basically the whole time to the white to the white flag, so <laughs> Yeah, appreciate it. Have a good one. All right. Uh, all right. So we'll see what happened out there. <laughs> this already looks scary. Oh no. I just missed the breaking point. Guy either braked a little too late or the other guy broke a little too early for uh, what they were expecting. Ooh, that's early enough in the race that can happen with those cold tires. I've done it a hundred times, if not more. Ooh, that one's interesting though. That's lap nine. That's pretty far into it. There was a long uh, silence in the middle of that one. He's taking the cone with him. Woo! Randy and Cone's bizarre adventure. There it goes. <laughs> I was wondering how far I was going to take it. Oh no, he's got more trouble. That's surprising, being from the number one. I wonder if uh, they normally run other cars or something. They're not quite used to this one. Bummer. Is that it? Is that really it? That's that's not it. Let me watch the other guys wreck. Let's see what else, uh, or how they wrecked at the end. Uh, okay, yeah, they're still up here right now. 
This is a guy that uh, thankfully didn't block us. I really appreciate that at all. You know, when I was saying don't block, because I was coming with enough head of steam. Oh, they didn't wreck. Wow, that stinks. He just, uh, he was trying to give it a 110% because he wanted to get past, but he just, yeah, he just misjudged the left sides, kind of like I was saying I did in the other corner. Ah, uh, bummer dude. He recovered pretty well, though. He still got fourth. So, if he was still here, I uh, I said I appreciated it. We're not blocking right there, so. I just uh, kind of was predictable and said, you know, I'm coming down here. And uh, he gave room, so that, that was cool of him. So I know there was a temptation, I'm sure, to be like trying to block it and trying to uh, prevent it, so. Alright, so. We got third as the number three. Wow, were we the only one? Nah, number ten had no incidents. They kind of just hung out back there, I guess. Um, one of two guys with no incidents. And we got ourselves a bronze. All right. Uh, the no incidents feels pretty good, especially because I'm uh, trying to go without that driving line now. So, All right, that's a success. Happy with that. <laughs> Thanks for watching. See you next time.